at Bank of America Stadium for this exciting matchup between the Chicago Bears and the Carolina Panthers. Hello, friends. Jim Nance along with Bill Sims. Partner, good to be with you today. Good to be with you, too, Jim. You know what we're going to see today? Two defenses that love to hit the quarterback. I'm glad I'm not playing. Pleased to bring in the third member of our broadcast team, Danielle Pellini, with the report from the sidelines. Thanks, Jim. Lots of time was spent this week talking about avoiding turnovers. Turnover differential is always very important, but this coaching staff harps on it even more than usual this week because they feel like this will be a close game that's decided by who makes a crucial mistake. Guys? Danielle, thank you very much. Now we'll go to the field. Panthers ready to get the pigskin in the air. That's a touchback, and the ball will be spotted at the 20. And now we've got what you'd call the Wiley veteran at quarterback, about to head onto the field for the first time today. Yeah, when you're a quarterback like this and, and you've had success, you go out in the field, you can't wait for the game to start because you veterans think only good things are going to happen to them. So they're confident and ready to go. First and 10, the handoff to Matt Forte. He's in the clear. He steps out. Bill, you always talk about establishing the run early, and they do it with that one big play. Oh, they sure did. This offensive line and that play, they put a whipping on the defensive linemen and linebackers that time, and a good job by the running back taking advantage of it. lining up here after picking up more than 30 on the previous play. First and 10. He's looking to the right here on this throw. Jay Cutler's favorite target is Brandon Marshall. Oh, shoot. Brandon Marshall would be any quarterback's favorite target. He can fight for the football. He's big and strong, and he had a tremendous year in 2012. The defense comes out in the nickel. Second down and seven inhales the pass. There's the tackle, but still, it's enough for the first down. What a way to start the game on offense. Picking up another first down for them. They are in rhythm, and now no matter what they call, they're going to feel like they're going to make it happen. Bennett's lined up now as a slot receiver. First and ten. Matt Forte gets it here, and he's tackled at the 32-yard line. Charles Johnson is coming off a 12-and-a-half sack season, and he is a large presence on that Carolina defensive front. That's what you need to have a good defense. Who's going to be your premier pass rusher? That's Charles Johnson, and also he's good against the run. Second and six. He gets it again on this drive. Bennett's a receiver in the slot. Third down and four. The throw to the left. And he was wide open. Good job by the receiver that time. Getting that extra couple yards. Gets a first down. They are marching. Let's see how the defense reacts. Matt Forte lined up in the Let's backfield. First and 10. Trying to work that left side. And that's a gain of maybe five. Always a good job to pick up some yards when you're in the red zone. Nice throw by the quarterback, and he gets the completion. Bennett's going to get set in the slot for this snap. Second and five. Screen pass. He makes the catch. Touchdown. Touchdown. 
Well, when your offense goes out there and scores a touchdown to put you ahead, it's got to give a big lift to the defense. they got to get excited and go out there and hold that lead. The Bears for the extra point kick. Count it. The Panthers' defense buckled on that first drive, and now let's see if their offense can respond. The score's 7-0. made right around the 26-yard line. Here is the 2011 NFL Rookie of the Year quarterback, Cam Newton. Olsen's moved from the tight end position to the slot. Newton's got it in the gun, eyeing that left side. What a hit, and the ball falls incomplete. This starting lineup is brought to you by Snickers. Snickers satisfies. Here's the offensive line. And for this team, they are the lifeblood of the offense. When they're blocking well, this team can do some serious damage. Second and ten. Throws to the right. The Panthers get a first down. Touchdown. Well, that score ties the game up. Now on the defensive side, you've got to come out there and take advantage of this, this feeling you got going now and get the football back for your offense. with a PAT to tie the contest. Makes the PAT. Newton's going to watch his defense come out here in a moment. He was good for over 70 passing yards on that last touchdown drive. Smartly takes the knee in the end zone. to the line and it's first down and the drop back looking for an open receiver on the right I think the best thing to say about that play it's just a, it gained a few yards so that's what you do all plays don't score sometimes you just want to pick up a couple yards The Bears come out with a split backfield. Second and one. Looks to his left. That catch gives them a first down. When you talk about the play action pass game, it's really when you call it. You got to be in a situation where the defense is thinking run, and when they are, do you have the courage, or I should say the smarts, to fake the run and throw the football. Good call that time by the offense. That reception gave them the first down. Flip to the outside. It's got some daylight. Good job that time by the running back. I'm sure he's a little winded after that play. He showed that speed getting out there and picking up those extra yards.
They're able to move the chains after that last run. Action fake, throwing now to his left. Quinton Michael makes the tackle. It's always good when your quarterback is able to deceive the defense with good play action fakes. That's what did it that time. Look at the quarterback. Nice fake. Defense reacts to the run, and now you throw it over the top for the easy completion. That was a big gainer. Now it's time to back it up. Forte's taking the handoff. Nice tackle. Matt Forte is just one tremendous runner in the NFL. That time he picks up big yards. He just keeps getting the job done and goes unnoticed. I don't know why, but he does. First down here after the run. Matt Forte to the right side. Has a terrible read by the running back. It's a short game, but it's all his fault. He picked the wrong hole. He should have cut it back. He didn't, and that's why he was tackled. 15 minutes down, 45 minutes to go. And we'll return after this message and a word from your local station. The Bears on offense here to start the second quarter. Play number six coming up on this drive. And the second quarter is underway with this snap. Nice catch by the receiver, but it still doesn't get a first down. The offense heads to the line for the seventh play of the drive. The pass complete. He stacked up at that point. Good play call that time by the offensive coordinator. Down inside, when you're inside that 20-yard line or the red zone, find ways to complete the pass. They did that time. The defense is ready to plug up the middle here on the goal line. The handoff to Matt Forte. Hard to score a touchdown sometimes when you get in the red zone in the NFL. Why? Because the defense doesn't have to worry about passes down the field. The offense runs it. They are ready to get it done, and they do, and stop the offense for a short game. Second and goal from the three. Has it. Touchdown. Good job on that touchdown. That puts them ahead, and it's always, of course, better to be ahead than behind. The Bears with the PAT to come. And the point after is good. Bears ready to kick the football. And the tackles made right around the 26-yard line. Cam Newton takes a look now from under center. First and ten, D'Angelo Williams for about five. Six 
setting up in the pistol on this play. Second and five. Newton connects with Steve Smith. Well, Jim, I always say it's about deception when you're playing offense. That time, the play action fake by the quarterback was so good, the defense didn't even see that he still had the football, and he throws it down there for a nice completion. Olsen's a tight end, but lined up in the backfield for this play. First down and 10. They're going to run it right. That'll put them in what we call plus territory. After that long run, that running back deserves a break. Go over to the sideline, let a few guys pat you on the rear end and tell you how good you are, and then get a little oxygen and get back in the game. What a run. The Panthers lined up in the pistol. First and ten. Working that left side. Incomplete. Almost going in the other direction. Well, that pass is incomplete, Jim, but that's just a terrible job by the quarterback. When they're running the slant route, just throw it right at the stump. Second down after the incompletion. About midway, second quarter, he'll take the snap. He's wide open for the grab. Down to the 15. The best way to keep the other offense uh, on the sidelines is just keep marching down the field and picking up those first downs. What a good job by the offense. Long gain sets them up here on this play. And Williams is going to take the handoff now. Power running. A lot of teams in this league don't even do it anymore. This team, they can power it up in there and pick up those tough yards. Williams is in the backfield. He'll throw it over the middle. That's a gain of eight. Nothing too exciting here, just plowing ahead, getting closer to that goal line. Well, they're trying to find out if this defense has the courage and toughness to stand up to them. So far, they haven't. This defense, they better pick it up if they think they're going to stop this offense. Halftime is coming up, but first, we reach the two-minute warning. Ready to make the stop on the goal line. Loading up that defensive front. So first and goal to go. It's handed to the running back. Into the end zone for the touchdown. I would bet... First and goal that the offense, about 90% of the time, is going to run the football. And what do they do here? They run it, and they get it done. That is power of football at its best. The Panthers will tie it up with this extra point. Add the extra point. The kick is good. The Bears ready to return the kick. Will they take any chances here before halftime after this game was just tied? Scores 14 to 14. The returner opts for the touchback and the offense will begin at the 20.
Bennett's lined up in the slot. Drop back, shotgun formation. Bennett's there with the sure hand to pull in the rocket pass. Well, that's a good route that time by the wide receiver. They call that a post route, and they call it a post route because he is running towards the goal post. Nice throw and catch. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Screen play is on. That brings the play to an end. There wasn't much there that time, so good job by the quarterback just throwing the ball and, and, and getting the catch and just getting a couple yards. The defense comes out of the nickel. Tight end in motion from the gun. He'll fire it out to the left. It's out of bounds incomplete. It's third down coming up. Snap back to the quarterback, out of the gun, looking to go deep. Oh, almost caught. Outstanding coverage on the deep throw, forcing the incompletion. That's why he's one of the best in the league. He's aggressive, he can take away short passes, but also has the speed and the ability to get back there and knock down those deep ones too. Hunters all set here. Again from the 17. And he's brought to the ground. Smith in the slot, first and ten. Going across the middle, Newton hooks up with Greg Olson. Second down coming up. Airing it out. And almost picked off. Well, for some reason, this quarterback likes to keep trying to go deep down the field against his cover, too. That's not the spot you want to go. You want to look underneath or right down the middle. After the incompletion. Third and four coming up. Challenges the coverage and has the completion. First down here after the completion. Newton's going back to the air on this play. That's Newton over to Olsen for the catch. The Panthers, one timeout remaining. Olson's usually a tight end, but he's in the backfield this time. They'll go shotgun here, challenging the defenders to the right side. Williams is in the backfield. Out of the shotgun, looking to the right side and throwing. He's almost intercepted. Just stick the football on him. When you see a receiver run a route like this, they're going to the corner, drive it, throw it on a line drive, so that way there can't be a mistake.
Smith lined up now as a slot receiver. Third and ten. He'll fire it out to the left. That's an interception. Gets past the first wave. And he's out of bounds. That interception is strictly on the quarterback. When you make bad decisions, I don't care how good you can throw the football. The results, usually it's going to turn into an interception. down on the way from the shotgun nice job that time by the wide receiver on the post route he's open but the quarterback throws it too far and misses it Matt Forte lined up in the backfield. They send the tight end in motion. Second down and 10. Charles Johnson gets to him for the sack. Third down here, offense trying to pick up the first. Takes the stab from the shotgun. Trying to find an open man. The defense comes up with yet another sack. The Bears elect to go for it and bypass the punt on fourth down. Quarters formation here for the defense. Launching it deep. Tough catch. And we'll be back to Charlotte after the break for the start of the third quarter. Time to check in quickly with Danielle Bellini from the sidelines. Danny? I got a chance to speak with Coach Rivera at halftime. Tie ball game here, guys. And Coach told me the second half is going to come down to a few plays. As a coach, you never know which plays they might be, but it always comes down to a couple plays here or there. And he just hopes his team will be on the right side of those plays. Guys, back to you. Thanks, Danielle. And now we'll go to the field. Williams is in the backfield. And here we go, the first snap of the second half. The Panthers now move the chain. Good job by the quarterback that time. He doesn't panic. He reads that it's a zone, and you have to wait for the receivers to get in between the defenders. Nice throw and catch. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. Cam Newton takes it from the shotgun. He's looking to the right here on this throw. Williams lined up in a single back formation. Second and ten. Throws to the right. The Panthers get a first down. Well, if you want to be a good play action pass team, it's always nice to have a good running game. Make the defense dig in and try to stop your run. When they do that, you fool them. You fake it, you throw it down the field. That that's that's about as easy as it gets. Lined up in the pistol formation. Now first and ten. Looking for a receiver on the left side here. How do you stop these receivers now? It's almost impossible with the rules of the game. Uh, tight coverage. That time they have double coverage on him. It doesn't matter. The throw comes. They go up. They make the catch. 
All you can do is raise your arm and go, well, we did our best. Williams out in the slot. First and ten. He's scrambling now. The defense gets a sack. Huge loss on the play. Defense comes to the line, ready to pounce on that quarterback one more time. Can they get another sack right here? Looking for an open receiver on the right. The pass is intercepted. Spins out of the tackle. He steps out. What a terrible job by the quarterback. But nobody's open. Tries to force the pass and look. What's it turn into? An interception. Marshall's a receiver in the slot. First and ten. Right side. And that's a gain of nine. What that run does, it just puts the offense in a good situation. So a good, positive run. Let's go. Two tight ends. Second down and one. That's just not a good call on the offensive side. Yeah, you know, when it's second and short, they, they think, well, let's just pick up the first down. If the defense was ready, you got to have better play calling in that. Third and short. They'll run it off the toss. The tackle was made, but the first down is picked up. Nice job that time by the ball carrier. Getting it just past the first down mark. Big first down. Keep the chains moving. set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. Quarterback taking the snap from the shotgun. Picks up five. Always manage the football game. You got to be thinking about it all the time if you're the quarterback. It's a tie game. You're down in here in the red zone. Be careful with the football. You at least want to get three points out of this. Matt Forte lined up in the backfield. It's a second and five here. The throw to the left makes the grab. They've got him down there. Another first down by the offense. The defense is definitely getting fatigued. And when you get fatigued, you cannot think. So look out. Bennett's going to get set in the slot for this snap. Out of the shotgun formation. And he's forced to the ground. Well, that's a sign of a good defense. When you can sack the quarterback when you're just rushing the defensive lineman, you don't need any tricks, you don't need any blitzes. Man, that's talent. This will be second down. The formation here, shotgun, trying to work that left side. Had it for a moment, but the ball is knocked out incomplete. Good anticipation that time by the defender. He gets to the receiver just as the football is arriving, and he makes a beautiful hit to knock the football loose. 
Third down on the way. From the gun. Challenging the defenders to the right side. No room to complete that one. Jim, when you get in these situations, there's not much you can do. Third long, not easy to pick up first downs in these type of situations. From 40 yards. try yes sir well that time the offense had great field position they don't take advantage of it but at least they get three points good job by the kicker coming in and getting some points on the board the Panthers are prepared to return the kickoff Tackled just past the 20. We'll mark it at the 22-yard line. First down here. Getting sacked. After getting sacked, it's now second and 18. <laughs> Running away from the pressure, eyeing that left side. Newton hooks up with Greg Olson. Uh, there's nothing the defense can do. When you talk about a receiver like these guys out there now, and, and this one in particular, the double coverage, they're still able to go in between the defenders, rise up, and make the catch. Offense lines up here. Newton's back in shotgun formation. He brings it in here, and he's got the first. When you play a cover three defense, you protect against the deep pass, but the problem is all the underneath stuff is wide open, and the quarterback is taking advantage of that. One more snap, and that'll end the quarter. First and ten. Looks to his left. That pass play. Picks up a first down. Has some space to work with. He's got the touchback. that time by the offense scoring that touchdown and putting him ahead and when you get ahead in a football game the National Football League it makes you relax and you play better The Panthers for the extra point. The point after is good. 15 minutes to go. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. And welcome back as we're about to get underway here in this one. The Bears set up for the kick return. They've just lost the lead, so need to try and respond. The scores 21 to 17. Escapes the hit, gets out past the 20 and brought down at the 24. formation for the defense here the final quarter underway now with this snap the 
What a nice lob pass that time by the quarterback. Just tremendous touch. He just floats it in there like a feather and gets it done. Nickel formation here for the defense. Second down and 10. Sticks to his hands. And that last play made by Quentin Michael. Nice job by the quarterback. Nobody open down the field. He throws it short. It does not get a first down, but it sure makes third down a lot easier. Bennett's lined up in the slot. Third and four. He's got the grab, and he's got the first. Seven-yard gain on the play. When you pick up first downs against the defense, they will get tired. That time, nice job by the offense getting the first down, even though they're losing here in the game. They've got a first down now after that catch. Tight ends in motion here. They're going back up top. That pass was hurried. Play doesn't even have time to develop. The quarterback is under so much pressure, he's throwing it before these receivers are even ready. Wide receivers stacked up on this play. Out of the gun. Looking across the middle with two hands, he has it. Oh, the, we've got an injured player on the field. In this game now, it's just so spread out. Everybody is so fast. Let's you just it. can't avoid it. Concussions are just part of the game, and uh, I hope he's okay. Play action fake, looking to throw. Oh, that could have been intercepted, but he couldn't hold on. This is frustrating for a coach. You call a play, you get the receiver down the field on a corner route, and your quarterback cannot put it on the target. All set to punt here. Again, will try his return. Good piece of tackling. Olson's moved away from the tight end position to now a receiver in the slot. First and 10. Ball is caught. Gains 11. Keep the momentum on your side. You got a lead here in the second half. Nice play that time. You pick up the first down. Let's see if you can take advantage of it. That reception gave them the first down. And Williams left side. Stop the play right there. <laughs> Running backs who can pick up extra yards, they are so valuable. You can't always block everybody to the ground. The running back's got to do it himself sometimes. Nice job there by the running back. They're able to move the chains after that last run. The Panthers now move the chains. There has been good pass protection for the quarterback all day long. He has not been sacked much, and he throws it there and gets another completion.
Olsen's playing out of position in the backfield here. First and ten, it's the old counter play. Good job getting the first down by the offense. So look at the defensive players on the sideline cheering their teammates on. Keep us on the sideline a little longer. That's what they're hoping for. Williams is in the backfield. First and ten. Throws the pass. Steve Smith makes the catch. Plenty of zip on that throw. Nice situation here for the offense. They're winning the football game. Now they're in the red zone. Let's see if they can come up with a play that fools the defense. First down, following the long play. Drop back, shotgun formation. Throws it in the end zone, touchdown. If you go to an NFL practice, they spend about 40% of their time practicing plays going in to score. That's why they made it look so easy here. Nice throw by the quarterback on first and goal. The Panthers lined up now for the point after. And the extra point is good. The Bears are ready to return the kick. Smart play here, just take a knee. First down here. Just a quick drop back. Oh, should have had it. Well, he dropped the football. And there's no doubt why he dropped it. You have to look it in. That's second down coming up. Tight end in motion. From the gun. Throwing now to his left. Going to be a tackle for a loss. Well, that's the new NFL. Just keep throwing it behind the line of scrimmage and see if the athletes can catch it and make some yards. None there that time, a loss of a couple yards. The defense comes out in the nickel. Let's go! We reach the two-minute warning. The Marshals in the slot. Third and 11. He's looking long. And it's incomplete. Defensive coordinators love this situation, don't they? Third and long. They can do just about anything, and it's going to work. And they stopped the offense that time. It's a dime look for the defense on this play. Snap back to the quarterback. Out of the gun. Complete. This doesn't look good. We've got a player down and he's in pain. Well, that's going to hurt him tomorrow. There's no doubt about it. When you get hit like that, you're going to feel some of that pain tomorrow. But the good news is, I think he's going to be okay. And once he gets a little um, uh, situated there, I think he'll be back in the game. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Setting up a 
little screen. Catch is made, nowhere else to go, and he's out of bounds. I know you won't believe this, but sometimes completing a short pass like that does give a quarterback confidence, so it does serve a purpose. Wilson's lined up now as a slot receiver. They send the tight end in motion. They'll go shotgun here. Working that left side. And complete. He'll be brought down, but not before picking up the first down. Bennett's lined up outside on the right. Back to the air here on first down. And he's thrown to the ground. What a play. Snickers is the proud sponsor of this satisfying defensive replay. When hunger hits, Snickers satisfies. Out of the shotgun. No chance to throw. Another sack. The defense comes out in the nickel from the shotgun. He'll fire it out to the left. And he's going to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. Quarterback coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a sixth time in this game. Well, we'll be switching sides with this one. Ball's going the other way. The defense has a lead here in the fourth quarter, Jim, so they're willing to give up those short completions. Now it's up to the defense. Come up, make the tackle. Good job that time. Two tight ends on the field here. The Bears have to call one right here, and they do, and they are out of timeouts. Following that timeout, defense back out on the field. And now they'll try over again on second down. Newton in shotgun formation. Escaping the pressure, he'll throw it over the middle. That ball has been picked off. He's brought down. Most NFL linebackers, they're borderline good enough to be a running back, and they got the hands of defensive backs. Here's a good case. What a fine catch on the interception by the linebacker. Miracles do happen, but this team's going to need one probably to pull this off. First and ten. Looking to the right side and throwing. That catch, good for a first down. When you're a quarterback throwing against zone defenses, look for the open space. That's what he did that time. He found it, and the receiver ran in there and made the catch. Wilson's a receiver in the slot. Now in rhythm, the quarterback drops back to throw once more. And a completion this time. Someone's been injured out there. Hold on a minute. Always hard to guess what the injury is, but and don't like to speculate, but I think it's pretty apparent. It's an upper body injury. We'll let you know when we find out. Takes the stab from the shotgun. He'll fire it out to the left, and he'll step out of bounds. Well, it doesn't look like much, but it really serves the purpose. Picks up the first down, and now they have a chance to open things up. That play will be challenged by the booth upstairs inside of two minutes.
After review of the play, the ruling on the field stands. So they took a second look, but the play on the field will stand. Matt Forte lined up in the backfield. First and ten. Secures it with two hands. The Panthers decide to take a timeout here, leaving them with only one. So they complete one and still at second down. Quarterback taking the snap from the shotgun. Makes the grab. Nice throw that time by the quarterback in the red zone. Gets a completion. And there's some tight spots, not a lot of room, so you got to really drive the football in there. Wilson's going to get set go. in the slot for this snap. First down and 10. Brings it in. The offense heads to the line for the seventh play of the drive. Jim, when you get inside the other team's red zone, inside the 20-yard line, and you're down some points, you're thinking touchdown in these situations. Now, looking at third down. Out of the shotgun formation. And he's going to be brought down. The Panthers have to take their final timeout. That's it. Nickel formation for the defense here. No time to even look up. He sacked again. So many ways to overcome your quarterback getting hit the sack. Throw the football quicker. Keep the tight end and running backs in. If you do that, he'll have time to throw it down the field. One more play, and it's in the books. That's going to do it here in this one. Bill, before we go, how about this win? How much will this one count? You know, Jim, all wins are nice. This one was done easy. You didn't have to sweat too much over it. You feel good, and you just enjoy the next couple days. Well, the highlight of today's game, Jim Nance, is this long, beautiful throw down the field by the quarterback. It is the play of the game, and he shows that arm strength off and also the accuracy to hit the wide receiver so he can pick up extra yards. For Phil Sims and all the crew at EA Sports, Jim Nance saying so long for now.